Interior design is so much more than the accents and colors that fill a space. Done well, interior design is rooted in purpose and intends to help all visitors engage with the spaces they are visiting. Tonight's honorees paid close attention to detail and functionality of the spaces designed. Let's take a look at the 2022 Monumental Awards nominees in interior design. The Achievement Award for Interior Design goes to the club at Crosspoint. With 35,000 square feet at Knowledge Services' disposal on the second floor of their building, we were tasked with imagining a high-end co-working space for individuals and teams who now make up the immensely expanded hybrid workforce. Anticipating that needs evolve and change with business growth, a modular wall system was used to accommodate rapid configuration. Dubbed The Club, the design intentionally offers individuals more agency over their environment, with choices ranging from private office suites to hot desks to tucked away nooks. Individuals have a robust selection of work styles to cater to their specific needs. Congratulations to Delve Design. The Merit Award for Interior Design goes to North Mass Boulder. Vacant for decades, this former box factory is now home to North Mass Boulder, complete with towering white birch climbing structures, state-of-the-art fitness rooms, and a co-working cafe serving healthy food and drink. Historic preservation allowed for old materials to be reused in exciting new ways. The facility folds working and playing into one seamless environment with intuitive color-based design and wayfinding. Two murals by artist Shogo Ota are showcased throughout the space. The investment to preserve and repurpose this historic factory has brought new life to its local community and encourages continued renewal. Congratulations to Black Line Studio. The Honor Award for Interior Design goes to Barnes & Thornburg Vault Room Renovation. Originally built in 1903 as a bank, their office still houses the original vault room in the lower level. Working closely with their office property director and firm leadership, the three-year project weathered a global pandemic and a catastrophic flood to become a boardroom and event space, as well as the crown jewel of the office. Barnes & Thornburg originally approached CSO in 2019 with the goal of repurposing the vault to create a hospitality space in the lower level of their building. Inspired by images of moody smoking rooms and his own experiences traveling the globe, Don Williams, managing partner of Barnes & Thornburg's building partnership, set the tone for the transformation of the office's forgotten basement into a high-end hospitality space. The design team took this vision and layered in elements inspired by the historic details of the building, as well as elements that embraced the unique story of the vault. The final design modernizes the classic detailing found in the original building design. The perimeter of the conference lounge space showcases a frieze made up of an egg and dart detail found in grades throughout the building. The frieze frames a Scales of Justice oculus similar to the one seen on signage at the front entry of the building. Also seen on the front entry, and throughout the building, is a jack and cross motif which inspired the gleaming metal bar front and a backlit metal ceiling tile in the bar area. At either end of the primary gathering space, bookcases are anchored with green safe deposit boxes which were intentionally preserved in their unrestored state, adding character to the design and embracing the vault's storied journey. The team redesigned a storage room and a vault access room into a breakout room and anteroom that can be used for small group discussions during parties and meetings. Each of these is also set up to support the availability of an IT professional during meetings with high reliance on technology. The client reached out to multiple firms to help create the space they envisioned. 
After several attempts and several years, CSO was recommended for the project and immediately understood the client's vision. The documentation and MEP coordination phase took place in the first half of 2020, during the pandemic, from the team's dining room tables and spare bedrooms. Great care was taken to minimize the appearance of any MEP elements. Diffusers are recessed into the perimeter light cove, intakes are hidden behind the decorative frieze, and a seamless access panel divides one of the coffered ceiling panels in half. The interiors team also coordinated with Barnes & Thornburg's in-house AV group to set the boardroom up as a state-of-the-art Zoom room. Construction was postponed until 2021, and when the project was a mere two months from finishing, a water main on the street above burst and the vault was flooded with water. Remediation was conducted, new flooring was ordered from Italy, and finally, in February 2022, the vault project was completed and its first events were held. Congratulations to CSO!